The men's and women's volleyball seasons are now underway. The men came out triumphantly trying to match their Nationals medal magic from a year ago with two wins over Graham McEwen. Despite the victories, head coach Ryan Marsden knows his team can be better. Like, this is the type of group that wants to win an ACAC championship. They want to win a national championship, but yet they're struggling to do it every single point. They're satisfied right now with just doing it some of the time, and that's not good enough. The women didn't fare quite as well against the Griffins, but the season is still young. Both squads will face Lethbridge in the coming weekend. Over on the ice, the men's hockey team continued its dominance over rival Nate with back-to-back -back wins over the Ukes. Head coach Ken Babby says last week's loss against Portage had a factor in his team's effort. I don't think they wanted to come to Monday morning practice at 6.30 like they had to do last week. <laughs> to be honest with you, as soon as I said see you Tuesday, there was a big cheer. Babby and his boys will have to keep their winning ways next weekend as they face Augustana. The women's team double up the Ukes Friday night before suffering their first loss of the season. Next, the girls will play Grant McEwen. Back to the courts, the men's basketball team were able to grab their first wins of the season against Briarcrest, including an overtime thriller Friday night. And the women kept on rolling, dominating the Clippers to keep their record perfect, outscoring the Clippers by an outstanding 103 points in just two games. Head coach Donovan Martin says his team was hardly lacking motivation. You know, it's tough to come back after that the night before to come out with energy, and I thought we came out with a ton of energy for this game. Were you here for the start of it? Yeah, 28-3. Yeah. to three, yeah, yeah, we just came out and blew the doors off right off the bat and, uh, and uh, carried on for the whole game, really. We didn't have much of, a, much of a letdown. Both basketball teams will play Lakeland College before squaring off against the Kings University College this weekend. That's all for this week. Stay tuned for more from your state Trojans.